Hi, uh, I'm Peter. I'm president and treasurer of the uh, Keswick B Condo Association in Florida. And I am uh, working with HOA Express on their uh, website development, on, on the website development for our development. And uh, I would rate them as a five. I've been very happy with their uh, support and performance. Uh, we are a 20-unit uh, uh, condo development uh, building, and I use HOA Express to develop the website uh, for our unit in, a, in order to communicate uh, important information to our owners. Well, I'm, I'm new to website development, so I, I was very uh, concerned about whether or not I would have the capability uh, to develop the website and how much time and effort it would take me. Uh, so I looked first on online at various uh, 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 website developers, and I looked at Wix and uh, GoDaddy because I had heard a lot about them. And then I also looked at HOA Express because one of the uh, owners in another building had used them to develop uh, their website for their building. And when I looked at all three uh, of those developers, uh, I came to choose HOA Express because they were geared specifically uh, to condominium developments. Uh, the HOA is a homeowner association and we are a condo association which is very similar to an HOA and uh, I found that all of the uh, items that were in uh, their their template uh, were very specific for uh, condominium developments uh, such as ours uh, whereas I didn't need to customize a, a platform to make it fit uh, their platform and templates fit exactly to what I needed for our our website. Uh, so I chose HOA over the other two. Uh, even though uh, HOA was two or three dollars more per month, uh, I felt that was uh, minuscule compared to the benefits of uh, using HOA Express. I, I found in, in developing uh, the website, first, first of all, it took me much less time uh, than I expected. Uh, but uh, there, there were also some features that were not uh, self-explanatory. Uh, for instance, when I went to the members uh, page and entered the information for our owners, uh, I find that the, the, there were certain idiosyncrasies. Uh, for instance, one had to uh, click on the name in order to get additional information, and it wasn't obvious uh, that I needed to do that. So uh, I wound up having to talk to uh, uh, HOA Express to Meredith there uh, on the uh, chat uh, and she was uh, able to explain it to me so I found that all of the features that I wanted were there but uh, not all of them were obvious when I navigated through through the website uh, so I added language onto various pages in order to get our owners uh, to understand how better to use use those pages uh, another feature is that, uh, that I had some difficulty with uh, was uh, getting the members' uh, information loaded onto uh, the website. And I, I got help uh, from uh, HOA uh, Express from Meredith there through the chat, and she formatted the information in the way it needed to be. Uh, but I would have been willing to do that uh, had I had enough instruction uh, to do that. So I felt that uh, a user manual uh, would have been helpful uh, when I was going through all of that. Uh, but having said that, uh, th those uh, issues were more anno annoyances than problems, and they were easily resolved once I, I contacted HOA Express. Uh, they had solutions that were very readily implementable, and I got over those hurdles very quickly.